Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. This is another Saturday with Dad. As per request, another collection video. Because a lot of people have been saying, well, where's your Rolling Stones collection? Where's your Hendrix collection? Well, it's all going to be shown today. This collection will be very different to mine, personally. Uh, yes, there'll be a different slant on it. Um, but I hope this will be a nice journey to go on. I'll certainly enjoy it, and I hope Neve and you guys out there enjoy it as well. It's going to take a long time. This might be more than three parts. It could be end up being four or five. But let's start. So we're going to start with A. This is an Allman Brothers box set containing different live gigs and outtakes. A couple of albums, which I believe features uh, Jerry Garcia and uh also bob weir and bill kreutzman this is quite uh, an exclusive this box is set, quite it? an exclusive box set this is the allman brothers uh allman betts uh band this is uh a Fillmore west gig by the allman brothers loads of allman brother gigs uh, but this one is uh, with jerry garcia as of course <laughs> sorry about this as is this one and there is uh, another album uh which i wanted which I can't seem to get hold of, but... So, one of the very early Allman Brothers albums, we obviously know we've got this one. So, the next one is a more sort of like Southern California feel. It's the greatest hits album, but some great stuff, you know, Ventura Highway, Horse With No Name. So this is At The Drive-In, which was the band ahead of what the Mars, Mars Volta became, the Ashra Temple. A couple of the guys that went on to Tangerine Dream and, of course, the great the greatness that is Klaus Schulze. Uh, don't think many people in England may know this. This is the association, birthday. The average white band. Pick up the pieces. At a B. This is the band, the complete box set. Band of Horses, Cease to Begin. And also in Infinite uh, Arms, my truly favourite album of all time. Pet Sounds, The Beach Boys. If there was a rating out of 10, this would get 11. And not far behind, Surf's Up, Carl and the Passion's So Tough, Odelay by Beck, one of the great 90s albums. Odessa, The Bee Gees, Big Star, Big Star, great band. Next door all from the same band? Yes, this is Blackberry Smoke, that's alive. Homecoming concert, uh, like an arrow. So this one is the Whippoorwill, holding all the roses. Uh, find a light. And last but not least in the bees, one of the great, great country rock albums. It's the birds and it's sweetheart of the rodeo. Let us see now. Canned Heat. This is Living the Blues by Canned Heat, which is great. This one. Is, that's just boogie with can Canned Heat. Yeah. JJ Kale, Oki. When I was at school and I was massively into Prague and I was also huge deadhead, new riders and everything like that, I had a secret. I didn't tell anyone because it would be so uncool, right? I love The Carpenters. There it is. It's the singles. It's just singles, but man, what a voice she had. This is Johnny Cash, live at Ful Fulsom Prison. Johnny Cash, live at St Quentin. To all you English viewers out here, particularly uh, for, from the age of, let's say, 55 and below, you think of the band, the Charlatans, as a Manchester band that sprung up in the early 90s as part of the Britpop movement. These, this, you couldn't be further wrong from what I'm going to show you. Because this is the San Francisco Bay Area Charlatans. They sprung up at the same time as the dead. They're a San Francisco band, so that's the Charlatans. This is, in fact, an Israeli band. This is uh, Churchill's. So what I'm bringing out now is the two Chicago albums, which are great. Eric, John, Ginger. Fantastic. All their albums... Every single one, and in, uh, well, you know, obviously with the likes of Disraeli Gears, there we go. Wheels and Fortune, there's also a live album in there. The Four Way Street, Deja Vu. This is Crosby, Stills, Nash, The Cranberries, Rai Kuda, Borderline, and this is Bop Till You Drop. 
John Coltrane, a love supreme. I think some people were actually um, commented about this album. But yes, we do have it. <laughs> uh, Valentine Sweet, Coliseum. Give them enough rope. And London Calling, both by The Clash. And to D now. Kind of Blue, Miles Davis. This is Miles and also John Coltrane um, and Paul Chambers, Derek and the Dominoes, Layla and other stories. The Desert Rose Band, Toulouse Street, the Doobie Brothers, Captain and Me, my personal favourite, Stampede by the Doobie Brothers, Bob Dylan, Blood on the Tracks, Before the Flood, Dylan and the Dead, of course, Bob Dylan, Highway 61 Revisited, the Doors, Soft Parade. Uh, the oh, doors. These are all Doors. Waiting for the Sun. This is live in Stockholm, 1968. Absolutely live. LA Woman. Weird Scenes Inside the Gold Mine. Isle of Wight Festival. Strange Days. Yep. Some more E's. So this is Earth, Wind and Fire. ELO, Out of the Blue. I want to picture this. Two albums by the great jazz pianist Bill Evans. The Eagles Legacy. This is a, a set. Quite the box set, actually. Uh, which has all their albums, plus all sorts of goodies in it, like live albums and, you singles. know, the, and singles and things like that and inserts. Now, F. One of my greatest albums of all time. Flying Bur uh, Burrito Brothers, The Gilded Palace of Sin. It's Jose Feliciano, going a bit rocky again. Fire and Water, free. These are the Forest Rangers. If you watched um, Sons of Anarchy, you would have heard a lot of their music. Foo Fighters, There's Nothing Left to Lose. Fleetwood Mac, The all these, First Incarnation. All these next ones are going to be Fleetwood Mac. Just, just a compilation. Then play on. Live in Finland, Mr. Wonderful, a British prog artist that escaped the notice of everyone. I like this a lot. Mouse Proof, G.F. Fitzgerald. Next is G. Patty Griffin. Back to Prop, to Prog, Green Slade. Great album of the early 2000s, John Grant. I think it's Queen of Denmark. Somebody was asking me about this when we were doing the live albums. What? And so what about Rory Gallagher, the Irish tour? Here it is. <laughs> Acoustic set by Rory. The Go Town Project. What's going on by Marvin Gaye? We have a lot coming up for all you um, Grateful Dead fans out there. So let's start with the uh, solo album of Jerry Garcia. That's the Garcia Live album, the first one he did. This is the one with Howard Wales, who trolled. The very best of Jerry Garcia. Garcia Live gigs as a record day special at one stage. This is the complete works of Mont the great Miles Saunders and Jerry. Live Portland, Ready or Not. Another live album from Nassau Coliseum. This is live in Buffalo. This is All the Dead. Starting to get into the studio albums now. Terrapin Station. This one here's another live. This is in Stamford in Connecticut. Live at the Mars Hotel. Blues for Anna. Wake of the Flood, The Greatness That Is Europe 72, that dead album but in Winterland. I don't know what year it is. Uh, 71. American Beauty. And this one is the exclusive one, it's the limited edition. Unopened. Working One's Dead. This is another live dead album, which is fantastic. Grateful Dead 69. I just got this recently in the States. It's Chicago. Grateful Dead box sets of the gigs in 69. Oh, Fillmore West, this is one of my favourite albums of all time. Aoxamaxoa, Anthem of the Sun. This is on our picture disc. The Grateful Dead, this is one of the early concerts in 67. These are just Some compilation album. And I believe this, this is the first studio album of the dead. So all of these are from the same band? And... Government Mule. So this is by Fred. Parts two. This is the Deep End, part one and part two. We're all different bassists on. Uh, this is Dark Side of the Mule, their take on Pink Floyd uh, music. This one here is just called Government Mule. Oh, this one's a great album. This one here, 
This is life before insanity. This is great. Uh, so this is high. Is this high and mighty? Yeah, it is. This is um, Deja Voodoo. Shout. Dub side of the meal. Uh, the next. And this is also high and mighty coming up. Both uh, recorded with the help of the wonderful, lamented Toots Hibbert. Uh, and this is a live album. And this one is fantastic. It's, I think, their best album, Dose. This is another album, uh, the Telstar Sessions. Uh, this is with John Schofield, Sco uh, Mule. <laughs> this one here, the last one here, which is Stone Side of the Mule. So this is a compilation of uh, Rolling Stone songs. That one is the latest one here. Was it um, Revolution Come, Revolution Go? Now on to H. The Jimi Hendrix Experience. This is a box set. This is a box set. Are you experienced? That's as bold as love. Electric Ladyland. Hendrix in the West. Band of Gypsies. And this one is Steve Hillage, L. This one's the great Nicky Hopkins. This is more prog Irish rock. This is the horse slips. The, do uh, the toy in, hot tuna. Uh, that's another hot tuna album. And this is also hot tuna. As of course this one is uh, Robert Hunter, Tales of the Great Run Runners, uh, lyricist for the dead. And somebody was asking about this when we we're doing our live records and saying, what about rocking the Fillmore? A few people asked about that. Here it is, rocking the Fillmore, humble pie. Next is I. So this is It's a Beautiful Day, Marrying Maiden. Again, It's a Beautiful Day. Serialistic Pillow, Jefferson Airplane. This is sort of kind of like a, yeah, a kind of a compilation between loads of people from the dead, Airplane Quicksilver, to Baron Bomb, Tollbooth and the Clo uh, the um, Chrome Nun. Jefferson Airplane Live album, which is uh, about 30 seconds over Winterland. This is J now. The Jesus and Mary Chain, yes, 80s rock. The absolute epitome, uh, Aqualung. A absolutely brilliant remastering, Jethro Tull. So, Mad Man Across the Water, Elton John at his finest, together with this one, Captain Fantastic and the Dirt Brown Cowboy. Caribou by Elton John. And, of course, now the great voice, Janis Joplin. Oh, this is what Pearl... Oh. Oh. And you're probably wondering why the cover is... The inverted colours, this is a special edition, isn't it? Yep, yeah. Unknown Pleasures. This is a 12-inch single of Love Will Tear Us Apart. First pressing. Yeah. And As first is this, pressing. of Atmosphere. You got them when they came out, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, and, of course, the, the wonderfulness that is Closer. By all Joy Division, those. So I'm currently editing this video, and I realised that we forgot to do an outro. So I'm going to have to do it now. Thank you guys for watching. This is part one. Tomorrow we're going to film part two. Uh, my dad's collection's a wee bit bigger than mine, so it might even be pushed into Monday as well. I hope you enjoyed seeing my dad's collection. Very, very different to mine. There was some stuff in there that some of you guys have asked if we have. Some of the kind of lesser known prog stuff, like the Coliseum and the Greenslade album. Also our Hendrix collection. So I hope you enjoyed that and answered, and uh, we answered your questions. So uh, yeah, see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.